I'm Forrest Saunders outside the state capitol, an incredibly successful grant program helping Floridians harden their homes against hurricanes is very close to getting refilled for another fiscal year. And lawmakers also considering moving it to condos. Wednesday was the latest win for the My Safe Florida Home Program. Yes, yeah, so by your vote, CS for SB 7028 is reported favorably. State senators and committee unanimously sending it to the full chamber for consideration in the coming weeks. <laughs> its goal, hearten more homes against hurricanes like this one, providing those who qualify with up to 10 grand in grant dollars to install things like these impact resistant windows. Hurricane comes, hurricane goes. I don't have to worry about doing anything. I don't have to worry about coming out and doing anything. I don't have to worry about installing anything. I don't have to worry about chasing down panels. I don't have to worry about stuff missing. But the added benefit, so say supporters, a stronger home means cheaper insurance. It's lowered premiums on, on the individual's insurance policies. Some, uh, I think the average was eight to $900 uh, per policy. So that's significant. Senator Jim Boyd's bill refills the program's coffers with more than $100 million for the next fiscal year. It also has new rules, putting low-income and senior homeowners first. So it prioritizes, as we haven't done in the past on My Safe Florida Home, to those that uh, probably could use the help the most. But that's not all lawmakers are hammering together. A pilot program is in the works to create the My Safe Florida condo program. So the idea was we have this wildly successful program for homeowners. Why shouldn't it also include homeowners who live in condo associations? Rep. Christine Hunshofsky is a sponsor and says the initial run would allot $25 million and again target low-income elder populations. We're going to see how it goes, see how popular it is, see if it needs to be tweaked, if some of the definitions need to be tweaked. Um, but the point here is that we want to help. Help that Floridians will tell you is needed as they continue to fight high prices and Mother Nature. Now, both of these pieces of legislation for condos as well as homes, they rely on that bigger bill, the budget, which is still working its way through the chambers behind me. The good news here is that Governor Ron DeSantis is a big fan of the My Safe Florida Home program, even calling for it to be a permanent fixture in the legislature. But we'll have to wait and see if that happens. That's the latest out here at the state capitol. I'm Forrest Saunders reporting.